Hello everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Lindsay. Welcome to my channel. Um, if you are new here, we do cash stuffing, savings challenges, sinking funds, um, cash envelopes, and just a little bit of life in general, all through the glory and by the grace of God. And those of you that have been around and that have already subscribed, thank you so much. I truly appreciate you guys. I'm so excited to um, continue to get to know you and your journey and see where you guys are going with everything. Um, if you have not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button down below. You'll get notified anytime that I post a video. And if you like my content, um, then you should stick around. I usually do my mini savings challenges on Mondays and then every other week I do a bonus sinking fund video. All right, let's go ahead and get started today. Yeah. This week we are doing 120 into our um, savings challenge. So again, this is coming from my little side hustle, which I'm so, so, so grateful for. It's been working out really well for my family. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. So I hope that you guys um, had a really good Easter weekend celebrating, honoring Jesus and his sacrifice on the cross for us. Uh, we had a really good time. We did like a little spring fling with our church. We did our church service. We uh, did some dinner with friends. So, you know, just so grateful. Um, so, you know, thankful and uh, always love remembering why we celebrate Easter um, for the incredible sacrifice, you know, that Jesus performed for us on that cross. And, um, yeah, my heart just, you know, it's, it's heavy, but it's also so thankful and grateful, um, you know, for what he did to wash our sins clean for us and accept us into his arms and love us. It's just incredible and amazing. Uh, oh, real quick. I did add another new item in the shop. I laminated these. So I just wanted to show you guys what they look like. It's a little hard to see when they print out, but there is a marble background on them. Um, I just thought they were really cute. I thought they paired nicely with the other like coffee and donut items that I got going on in the shop that you guys have been loving. Um, so you could use these as little trackers in your cash envelopes. All right. So we are starting a new 32 envelope. So we went ahead and... Um, finished out that other one which oh no I forgot my rock hold on okay my son is so cute he like loves seeing that I still use this but it really truly helps <laughs> keep this open so yes we're starting a new 32 envelope and I did do the other um I'm using the other one that's the little sunflowers that's so cute um and I do I did go ahead and laminate this one so for this, we're going to go ahead and do the 1, the 8, and the 32. Let's go ahead and knock out the 32. Um, but we're going to be putting 41 in. So I'm not going to get the small bills. We're just going to go ahead and do 41 here. All right. And then we can get to coloring and to chatting. So you guys, I, um, you know, I just want... To take a moment and you know I, I just really can't tell you how much whenever we're we're worshiping or when we're talking about everything in church I just oh it's like crazy because I imagine everything that you know Jesus went through um, on the cross and it just it is crazy and it just reminds us you know that we also have to carry our crosses every day right and it also reminds me um, that there's always going to be some types of, you know, battle or struggle or troubles and storms. But, you know, that wasn't that wasn't part of the promise, right? That life was going to be easy. And it's the fact that he will be able to be there to help overcome them, to um, get you through that. And um, I just think that that's, that's really a good reminder. So right now we are, um, I'm sorry, you probably have heard me like sniffling. So... We're going on like day three of no sleep. My daughter is teething and it is really, it's been challenging. She is cutting four teeth right now and um, she has been absolutely miserable. She's just not sleeping through the night and now she's kind of got like the cold going on with it. And of course that means I'm not sleeping through the night. So um, I'm sorry, you, you probably hear me like a little bit nasally and sniffly and it's one of those things where, you know, you have to continue to just 
push through, right? Like I could have very easily just been like, nope, not doing a video. Um, hopefully you guys don't mind too much that, <laughs> that I don't sound 100%, but I'm gonna do my best. I also came down to record and you guys know I've had my technical issues with my phone storage. Well, don't you know, I'm also having issues with my ring light. So I come down to record and this has kind of been a problem. Um, my husband's had to help me with a few times like turning the knob and getting the light to actually come on. Well, today he wasn't here and I couldn't get it on. So I, again, could have just been like, you know what? I'm not doing it, but I will not back down like that. Um, I'm not going to give in that easily. So eventually I did get it to turn on and to work and I used another light and hopefully it's bright enough for you guys. Um, but man, there's just so many ways where we can be pushed um, and tried and you know, discouraged, right? So we have to always uh, kind of persevere, push through that and um, know that it's okay. Things don't have to be perfect. Um, Faith-based budgeting, she is fantastic. You guys have to check her channel out. But she had, oh, I gotta color another one of these, sorry. <laughs> she had such a good message about that um, on one of her videos. It's the one where I think she's doing like the cash envelopes. And you know, she just talked a lot about that you know we don't need to be perfect um like there's we don't have to have perfection and that's so so true and i know i have to remind myself of that all the time because like sometimes you know you do strive you want it to be like perfect but it doesn't have to be it can just be real right it can just be um close to perfect or you can at least just trying your best and putting that effort in is better than perfect all right so we did 10 in this one. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, and 90 in here. Um, so yeah, I think those are good messages to, to remember um, that we don't always have to have things perfect because we, as humans, are not perfect and that is okay, right? That is just how, that's how we are. Um, that is a, that's just a part of, of life and we're also created different. We're all created different and we can celebrate our differences and our uniqueness and that's what keeps everything so interesting and keeps things fun. Um, you know, and I, I don't know, we just all, we all serve a different purpose. We all have a different mission. We all have a different path that God is leading us on. Um, so, Okay. Plant, let me color. You know, guys, I always mess this one up. So I'm doing, let's see, 10. All right. So, yes, we've just, it's been crazy in our house. Um, you know, hopefully here, like, soon we'll be feeling a little bit better and getting sleep. I know the sleep has been, like, the lack of sleep has been the biggest uh, part of the challenge. So, and then... The video that I'm going to do later this week, guys, okay, so the other thing is we finally, so Ian finished his challenge and he got his hermit crab, which I plan to show you guys in the next video. Um, so you'll have to stick around and stay tuned for that. 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 70, 80, 90. Okay, that's right. <laughs> um... What was I saying? Oh, goodness. Oh, so yeah, the hermit crab. So we're going to show you that in the next video. But guys, I truly do not even understand. I think I'm allergic to it. And like I, I have a lot of allergies. I think I've told you guys this in previous videos. I'm very sensitive to things. But who would have thought that I was allergic to a hermit crab? I mean, come on. I, I seriously think I'm allergic to hermy. Um... And Ian is so sweet because right away he was like, it's okay, mom. Like, we can take him back to the pet store. I don't want you to be suffering. And I'm like, oh, I don't want to have to do that. But at the same time, we might not have a choice. So Hermie's been staying out in the camper because literally the two times that we brought him in, like, I, my throat starts closing up. I can't breathe. My eyes, like, get so swollen and watery. And then um, I just start sneezing, like, off the chart. I've literally had to use my inhaler both times um so yeah it's just it's crazy so I feel bad because he worked so hard to save up for that and now we're trying to figure out what we're gonna what we're gonna do um we do have a dog but Tucker is hypoallergenic so 
he doesn't really shed and I've never had an issue with that um so I don't know what it is guys it's just it's just bizarre all right so we're doing 40 whoops 40 in this one I really need to swap this out this one's getting thick with the smaller bills that I have in here um let's count this up 20 40 60 80 1 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. So 160. I need to get like 100 to swap in there. Um, I don't have it right now, but at some point I need to do that. So yeah, anyway, um, you just you just never know, I guess, what, <laughs> what you might be allergic to or what you might not be able to tolerate. Um, I just can't even... Mm. I feel bad. So we're going to have to be thinking about maybe another, maybe a fake pet or a fish. <laughs> if I can talk him into that, I mean, who knows, guys. And um, we're still on the hunt for a new vehicle, too. I don't know if I've talked to you guys. Why did I unclip this? I, like, don't even know what I'm doing. I'm so delirious. Like, truly, I can't even focus. Um... But, yeah, we're still trying to find a vehicle because car prices are just nuts, nuts, nuts. Okay, gas, we are doing a three, so we're doing three, seven, and nine, okay? So let me go ahead and color in, and then we'll stuff the rest of this. Um, and I'm trying to keep this video a little bit shorter because I feel like I'm going to have to go blow my nose again. <laughs> Gosh, guys, I hope that you guys are not, um, you know, suffering as much with allergies. But I know here between the allergies and then whatever little cold my daughter has, like, it's been crazy. And it is also, um, it's so warm here. And it's just like everything. The pollen is so thick. Everything is starting to bloom. And yeah, of course, my kids love to be outside. So we literally spend most of our week outdoors, which is fun. And I love it, but I just got to get through this season right now. Like, literally, this season uh, is making me struggle. Okay. So, we'll put the rest here, and we'll count it up. All right. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. All right. 25 towards gas. Trying to save a little extra in here. Put towards that gas budget, guys. It's been crazy. Um, you know, also, we're trying not to drive too much, but we've had some events and things going on lately for school um, and for his co-op. So we've had some things where we have been driving a little bit more. No, I can't get that back in. All right. And then also, real quick, I wanted to ask you guys. Um, so I'm thinking about the giveaway that I'm going to do for 500 subscribers because I would love to do something. Um, what do you guys think about possibly doing something similar? It wouldn't be the exact same binder like this, but like something similar to the A7 size. And then like um, it would be basically be a, like a little mini savings uh, binder, like what I have, similar. Um, if you guys would be interested in that, let me know in the comments. I have a few other ideas I'm still playing around with, trying to figure out which one I want to do, what I like the best. Um, and I also have an idea for those of you that are not US based. So yes, I think my light is like dimming. I don't know what's going on. But anyway, I thank you guys so much for tuning in. Sorry if it was a little crazy today <laughs> with, with me not sounding the best, but I really appreciate you all. And please make sure you tune in to my next video where I will be going over all my sinking funds. We'll be stuffing the 32 envelope challenge from the last week that I finished up. And then I'll also show you our poor little hermit crab, which maybe having to get rehomed. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope that you have a blessed rest of the day and I will see you soon.